Hi, Melinda Elmer with Sensory 21 Masters. Thank you so much for watching my video blog. Today, I'm here to talk about hero loans and pace loans. And now, these loans are certainly being touted all over the place as great opportunities to be able to do energy efficient upgrades and things to their home. Now, I certainly will give you your own opportunity to go and investigate those loans and find out what they are. Um, it's very easy to find out more information about them. Um, but there are some things you really want to be aware of if you're planning on selling a home and you have one of these types of loans. Now, the important thing is, is that these are basically loans against the home. Now, a lot of the salespeople who try to get you to get these loans uh, will tell you, oh, well, it's just not a big deal. It's just a little bit of extra payment that gets rolled up against your property. And that's exactly true. You will have some payments on them. You might have six months or a year to not have to pay them back, but eventually they do need to be repaid. And sometimes that cost, if you're going to sell the home, is going to have to come out of your existing equity. So I have a couple of clients recently who sold homes, and they did solar panels, and they did a new paint uh, job on the home. Now, those loans against the property have to be repaid. And the salespeople, again, will tell you that uh, it could be transferred to the new homeowner. Now, that is possible, but think of it like this. If you were... I'm going to remodel your home and get a home equity line of credit or do a cash out refinance to upgrade your kitchen. Uh, the new buyer wouldn't take over those payments. They just buy the home at that value that you chose because the home has increased in value. Uh, but they're not going to take over the payments on your mortgage, typically speaking. They're going to get their own new mortgage and have their own payments and qualify for that mortgage based on their particular situation. So um, it's not going to happen that somebody's going to take over the payments for that hero or pace loan. So if you're selling the property, you should expect that you will have to pay that off as a part of selling the property. Then the other side of that is if you do want to look at these programs, and you're planning on holding on to the property, it may be a great way that you can um, basically make some of these energy efficient upgrades, solar panels, uh, insulation, uh, heating and air conditioning, things like that that are going to upgrade your home, but you can still enjoy it and enjoy some energy efficiency savings. However, you may not want to do them if you are going to sell the home in the near future, or you may want to plan to pay cash on it. If you're planning on holding on the property long term, no problem. Or if you're planning on keeping it as a rental in the long term as well. If you have any questions about this or any other uh, real estate related questions, I'm happy to help. My number is 562-316-2915. Feel free to forward and share this with any of your friends who may be thinking about doing energy efficient upgrades because it's better to know before they do it. Or you can also email me at melinda at the Thanks so much for watching.